Hello everyone. Now this video will show you the latest hard drive firmware repair and data recovery solutions for Hitachi hard drives. Now we have power on the drive and we select the family here. So this is one uh, IBM family uh, hard drive and this is ARM. And most Hitachi drives belong to this family ARM. This one is off drive. So we select this one and we can see here is the family list. Once the drive is detected and the family and the ID information can be obtained automatically. If not, users can try to use the auto detect. Then click OK to enter the Hitachi firmware repair program. Now we can see for this IBM hard drive, we can find all the firmware operations here. So users can read write modules, ROM, MVRAM. So for Hitachi drives, there are several parts of firmware. The first part is the modules on the platter. The second is ROM and MVRAM. MVRAM is included within the ROM. And here is one uh, function called edit the MVRAM. This function will help users to edit the head map. Sometimes when one or two heads are weak, and the users can edit the head map here to get the drive detected and readable. So to add head MVRAM is very helpful. Sometimes when uh, MVRAM is corrupted, users can to regenerate the MVRAM for IBM. For ARM, users need to extract the MVRAM from the ROM. And here is one more function called Recover Translator. So this is the Genius Translator. Head test, initialize HDD. This function is sometimes used for uh, DVR unlock or to repair the undetected Hitachi drives. Mostly for Hitachi drives, the firmware operations a lot so common. The only common solution for Hitachi drives is the sector access interruption fix. For this function, it helps when users swap the heads and then the heads become unstable. And in some cases, users can access just part of the sectors and this common Repair is also helpful. And with the DFL Hitachi from a repair program, users can also remove the password easily and also remove the DVR knock. Anyway, if users wish to edit the model and as a number, it's also very easy. Users just go to the general functions, edit ID, then users can do that. To reset smart, view smart, and move the defects from genus to playlist, is also very easy here, but these functions are for refurbishing, not for data recovery. So users need to understand correctly for each function, so the function can be used properly to avoid data loss. So this is a DFL Hitachi firmware repair solutions. Here is module list 
defector locks hex and these two the standby and the recalibrate these two are for the hot swap now let's check the common solutions within the DFL DDP data recovery equipment because this one the DFL Hitach from a repair program this one is just to, to repair the firmware corruption but if users wish to recover the NOS data users need to use the DFL DDP data recovery equipment and users can open the same drive on the DDP data recovery software and on the left side we can find Hitach. Now we select the virtual translator we can find out there are two options for 2.5 Hitach drives and 3.5 Hitach drives and here node mode this one is actually to note pianist to RAM. Users can read this pianist directly or note this pianist externally. So users can firstly back up the pianist with the DFA Hitach from a repair program and then come here, note file, select the pianist to note automatically. So this will help to fix the virtual translator automatically. So this one is very helpful, especially after swap heads or when users get the partial sector access cases. This option will be used. So these are the latest Hitach from our repair and data recovery solutions. And later, Dolphin Data Lab will add more new functions for both hard drive repair and data recovery for the Hitachi hard drives.